where have you been? Oh, Dad, I didn't know you cared. Oh. Well, where is this bath joint? Well, now there are three of them. One is nine blocks down that way on 9th Street. Yes, Dr. Rudeberg is here. But I can't very well call him out to talk to you now. He's in the steam room. Oh, well, I better go and see him then. Hold it! <laughs> no, I gotta see him. You can't go in there with your clothes on. Huh? There's only one way you can go in there. Yeah, how's that? <laughs> things up at the university. What university? <laughs> university. Aren't you Dr. Runeberg? <laughs> no, no. You, Dr. Runeberg? Yes, yes, it is right. Do I know you? Well, no, uh, but you know my sister, Betty. Okay, Professor, I'm ready for you. Come on. Yes, all right, I'm coming. Uh, nice to have met you. Oh, well, Doctor. Are you... <laughs> Better get dressed. Oh. I want a rub down. Okay, climb up. Eddie, we got a customer. All right, Max, I'm coming. Yes, sir. This one? Yeah, but take it easy on him. He's a new one. All right. <laughs> uh, Dr. Runeberg. Hey! <laughs> About my sister, Betty Anderson. Well, it wasn't her fault. It was my fault she couldn't get there. Actually, she's always on time. Very dependable. Very really smart, too. She's the smartest one in the whole family. She likes to discuss things like, uh, <laughs> like what people should watch people's <laughs> and what they believe in. <laughs> and the transitoriness of life. <laughs> you just talk too much, kid. Well, I got a lot to talk about. I got a great sister. That's a good way for a boy to feel about his sister. I remember my adorable sister. Cheated me out of $400. Hey, I got it. Got what? The reason you want me to take you fishing. There must be some good-looking game warden you want to meet, right? Yeah, that's right. And I'm going to marry him, and we're going to raise a little hammerhead shark and name it after you. 